Equality in the workplace. Sadly, that remains far from reality. A new report out of Akron calling attention to this issue. And it is especially a concern for women looking to land leadership roles. News 5's Taylor DeHayes looks at the progress here at home and how it's not across the board. Not one, not two, but 10 women judges all here in Summit County. One of those judges says that's putting them on the map and shattering glass ceilings. It really is still an anomaly in the state of Ohio. Take a look around this name and this one. All women running the show at the Summit County Courthouse after Tuesday's election. Judge Tammy O'Brien says it's a sign doors are opening. But in the private sector, O'Brien says that's another story. As far as CEOs and things like that, they are um, underrepresented. Females are underrepresented and certainly in the practice of law. Remembering the days she was outnumbered in her law office. For many years, I was the only female partner there, too. A study from the Akron Bay Center for Marketing Opinion Research taking a look at gender inequality in leadership positions. According to the study, women applying for high level positions still deal with discrimination and at times isolation, all because of their gender. The research comes from about 5,000 senior level leaders, almost all in the county. We have been fortunate that both of the political parties have recognized that uh, females are electable and are um, particularly in judgeships kind of viewed as um, inherently fair. Taking on cases and shattering glass ceilings, O'Brien says there's still a ways to go. If you're interested in attending the Women's Summit, the information is on our website. In Summit County, Taylor DeHayes, News 5.